Today we're looking at what would happen if every Minecraft mob was a villager. No surprise, they all come with their own unique traits. Tons of new items, armors, weapons, and so much more to heighten your Minecraft experience. Plus, a proper string of trades will get us the perfect item we need to barter with the Ender Dragon. Wish us luck. Our first villager convert today is the Creeper, and we've got our friend here, Drumstick, to tell us more. Now, this Creeper won't explode once we've tamed him with an emerald. As you can see, look at you, lovely. He's got a little villager belt on. This Creeper doesn't explode. Give him some gunpowder to get some TNT you can throw, or an end crystal chest plate that explodes when damaged. The last item is special. Hold on to it for later. Okay, so let's see. Trades. Nice. Hey, I'll trade that any day. One gunpowder for some throwable TNT. We've got an end crystal chest plate here. That looks lovely. And then we've got a one year beetroot supply. Uh, right. Okay, so let's check out throwable TNT. We've got some enemies. Hey, what's up, dude? Come on down. I know you see me. Okay, we're gonna maintain his distance. Uh, yeah. Oh, I just killed Drumstick. Uh, well, oh, you're back. Well, that's that's good. <laughs> so let's see if we can hit all the way. Let me look at that. Ah, oh, just missed. Ah, but good explosion all the same. This is useful. Let's check out this end crystal chest plate though. So this thing will explode when damaged. Let me see. Okay, that is quite useful actually. Can we just? <laughs> it's so cool. Look at that. No one's gonna mess with me unless they want to, you know, blow up and die. So, probably no one's gonna mess with me. Wait, so you're telling me we can turn a pig into a villager too? This pig builds house out of, well, nothing really. Anyway, trade it some carrots to get some plantable golden carrots. Interesting. Wow, nice. And also a better fishing rod. Well, that makes a ton of sense. Okay. Oh, wow, look at you. You got a fun little villager headband on. So, what are you about? Golden carrot for golden carrot crops. Okay, I could get behind that. We need a lot more golden carrots. I must have missed those. Or maybe we can plant these ones. Let me see. You go ahead, get nice and planted. That's useful. You can now plant golden carrots. <gasps> wow, love that. Yo, we just got so many so quickly. Here, I'm going to just load up real quick. Yeah. So a better fishing rod, and there's also a third item for later. I'm not entirely sure what that's about, but I guess we'll find out in due time. For now, gotta load up on some cabinet. Sadly, they probably won't all be explosive trays, but we've got a golden carrot fishing rod. That one looks amazing. Luck of the Sea, Lure 3, and Mending. Heals itself instantly. And then we've got, what? Oh. Oh, hey, we needed this beetroot supply from before, along with 32 golden carrots to get a squeaky dog bone toy. Uh, interesting. This seems like it's gonna be a series of trades. I'm curious what it all leads to. Meanwhile, let's see what we get from this, huh? Ha <laughs> ha look at that, we literally, <laughs> we've got golden carrot as bait. Did I just get, <gasps> you must be joking me, a netherite ingot? What else can we get from this thing? Wait, let me see. A diamond block. You must be joking. Let's see. Gold ingot. Wow. You can get some serious stuff from this, man. I need this fishing rod in my life constantly. Who'd have thought if you just tease people with gold, you'd get a whole bunch of cool stuff in return. Let's get one more item. Ooh, power three bow. Eh, acceptable. Okay, so we can also turn a skeleton into a villager. Let me see. Nice. Yo, you got something on your back, homeboy? Hey, hey, he's got a quiver on there. He's got something to trade. Okay, so what does he want? I guess he, what, trades emeralds or arrows, I mean? Yes, yeah, so you can trade him arrows to get lightning arrows. Come again. It's a good thing we fished up that bow. And also, chicken arrows. Interesting. And then what is this? 32 arrows for... And we need the squeaky dog bone toy for 1 million FPF sunscreen. That was hard to say. <laughs> okay, so we got the trade going. What do you have to say about this guy, huh? You got any uh, fine tune input for us? Bones of here will trade you arrows for arrows. Surprising, right? Is that a rib cage? Yeah, it must be. The lightning arrows fire lightning and the chicken arrows fire chickens. Sure, okay, so then let's see what this is all about. If I fire off one of these guys, 
Whoa, cool sound effect. Yo, I'm gonna summon in this baddie over here really quick. Let me see. Come on, get it. Yo, what's good? Oh, wow, nice. Love, ain't mad about it, in fact. Oh, drum! But wait, I have chicken arrows. There we go, not a problem, right? Wait, does it just... What? Does it just make a chicken noise? Let me see. How about if I... <gasps> what? Did we just turn the chicken into... <laughs> we turned him into a... Hold on, let me see. <laughs> okay, definitely a fan of these guys having traits. Okay, Drum, come on back. Had to summon him back in. Tell us a little bit about the zombie, huh? John over here, is this, is this, are you John? We'll buy some rotten flesh off of you. Whoa, buys his own remnants of his friends. Whoa, hi, John. <laughs> Looks like he really wants to trade me. Okay, rotten flesh, let's see, what do you got? What do you got? Ooh, zombie jerky recipe. Very interesting. So we just unlocked zombie jerky. Craft flesh in furnaces, and we get a pet spawn egg. Interesting. Oh, whoa. By the way, all of these third items are related to the Ender Dragon in some way. You will see soon enough. Interesting. But hold on, I can now cook rotten flesh. Okay, okay, okay. Well, what are these other trades you got? Rotten flesh for a dippin' dot. What? What is it? What's a dippin' dot? Let me see. <gasps> dot, and are you dip? Okay. That's dip, and then he's got dot right there. Uh, I don't... I don't get it. Uh, uh, maybe, maybe I don't need to. Is he my new pet, new friend? Sorry, drums. It's not the personal. Okay, so look, zombie jerky. Wow, a new food type as well. Very useful. But now we can trade this sunscreen with rotten flesh to get swim trunks. And somehow swim trunks are related to the Ender Dragon. Yeah, I'll believe it when I see it. Isn't that right, Dippin' Dot? <laughs> okay, so what is? Well, this guy's. He's not even here. Oh, the Enderman. <laughs> that makes enough sense. Well, we'll have to summon him in and quickly trade with... Here you go. Eh. Hey, Green-Eyed Jones. That's his name. All right, Drum. Tell me a little bit about him, huh? Catching Enderman's pretty hard. Why are they always blinking away? Yeah, I don't know. Whoa, literally disappeared. Use these prison eggs instead. Prison eggs. <laughs> we'll take your poppies for an item that destroys arrows. Shot at you. And an ender cake. Eat it and then walk around a bit and see what happens. Hold on. Arrow Wrecker. Arrow Wrecker for seven poppies. Okay. Did he just... Oh, I just... Man, just dipped out. Hey, I wasn't done trading him. I guess we just spawn in another. There you go, mister. How about this? I'll take a fresh ender cake as well. Oh, and you want the pants. Oh, the swim trunks for the enderman. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. So poppies plus swim trunks. And I get a turtle egg. For my trouble. Sure, why not? And I think I'm gonna lock dip and die in here. Meanwhile, let's put down the cake. See about this arrow wrecker. You gonna shoot something at me, homeboy? Let's see. What's good? What's good? What's good? Whoa, it legit just broke. <laughs> it just breaks on me. Wow. Actual arrow wrecking. Dude, this guy sucks. Okay, watch out, drum. I got I got business to take care of. Okay, well, I think I killed drumstick again. But at least we took care of that guy. <laughs> and I need to take care of him, too. Yeah, can you turn into a chicken of some sort, please? Thank you. Okay. Oh, gosh. Drum again. Okay, so what does this guy want to trade, huh? Come on. Whoa. He looks very different from before. We had to fish this one up. All right. Anyway, trade the drown some crystals to get a special fire-inducing trident. And flippers for faster swimming. I got to see this one. Hold on a second. Flippers for five prismarine crystals. Okay. Faster swimming. Netherite trident. Sharpness five. Fire aspect one. Wow. Yeah, he's no business getting that. And 11 prismarine crystals and a turtle egg for a diamond saddle. Okay. 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 Let's see what this one's all about, huh? Okay, dip and die. You stay right in there. Okay. So swim trunks, huh? Apparently I can... Oh, money. Yo. I move around so quickly in these. This is amazing. Yo, love. Love that. And he is just walking on water. I'm not gonna ask questions. <laughs> but I wanna see this trident, huh? What's good, homie? Boom. Catch him on fire. And he can't even damage me because of my helmet. Nice. This is sick. I'm gonna hold on to this one. Okay, drum. Buddy. Talk to me about what we're dealing- <gasps> Oh! Tell me about the Ravager. 
He's a big one. Be careful. We'll trade mutton for a horn that can summon friendly pillagers and a weapon with huge knockback. So we just need one emerald to make this guy like us. Hey! Oh, he's got gold on him now. Yo, he's been dealing in riches. Hold on a second. Let's see. Trade. Whoa. Whoa. So he likes mutton. Okay. I can trade mutton. So mutton for a war horn. Okay. And what does the war horn do? Summon friendly pillagers. So if I right click. Ha 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 ha. Does not, does not look that friendly. Just killed. Just killed Drum. Oh, miserable. It's his fault. He was the one that told me to summon him in. I don't know. I think he keeps just coming back though, huh? Okay. So a weapon with huge knockback. Knockback 25 on this guy. The Ravager Ram. So then, can I just punch on you? Can I just punch on you, homeboy? How about on Dip? No, Dip is impervious. How about this guy? Punch. <laughs> Where did he go? Where did he... Uh, <laughs> what? All the way over there? Oh my gosh. Amazing. Look, homeboys are all, all the way over there. Here, in fact, now that there's some serious distance on him... Let me see. Let me throw a couple of all the way that way. Go ahead. Ah, not enough range. But I can take out this guy closer, maybe. Maybe we can take out uh, this pillager right here. No. Uh, come on. There we go. In fact, I'm just going to suck. Let me see this final trade. So raw mutton plus a diamond saddle for some replacement blaze rods. Ender dragon, huh? We'll see, drum. Well, I assume this is going to... Yep. There it is. Blaze. Blazing saddles. Boom. Tame you quickly. Whoa. Green armed wonder. Loves to farm. Enjoys himself a good old ranch day. Okay, so tell me about him, huh? Super hot fire. Blazes will take your dust in exchange for a sponge that is better than normal. A molten sponge, huh? And that one only cost us 12 glowstone dust. Interesting. So how does it work exactly? And what else does he have for me, huh? Let's see. As well as a big blaze rod that can set mobs on fire. Don't forget the last item. <laughs> yeah, that is literally a big blaze rod. This one costs us... Ooh, fire aspect 10 on homeboy here. Okay. Okay, hold on a second. Let's summon in some enemies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now let's go mess with my big old blaze rod. And this is a molten sponge. So apparently this is better than normal. It... Hey. Can't argue with that. Can't argue with that. I mean, it disappeared right away, but it took out all of this water. That's pretty cool. Okay, hold on. I got to trade this final trade. Go ahead. Come on. I want a friend. I'm buying a friend. Wow, my dreams come true, guys. I finally have a friend. Sorry, drumstick. Nothing, nothing personal. It looks like there's only two more people to trade for now in villager form. Ooh, this one takes a block of emerald. I guess we're about to trade the wither. Come again. Let me see. Uh, yeah, I better, I'm just gonna, okay, I threw it on him right away, and he turned into homeboy right here. Hi. Alright, Drum, what's going on here? The wither is especially dangerous. Use emerald blocks instead of regular emeralds. Trade some saplings for a shield, huh? So he wants saplings for a shield. Interesting, that withers enemies. Let's see. Wither shield with unbreaking three on it. Yo, look at this thing. Very nice. So what, if I just use it against a bad guy? Let me see. Hmm. I, I can't tell if that was dip. <laughs> or... Or if that was my explosion occurring. Let's see. He's definitely being withered. He's definitely being withered. Or maybe it's just dip attapping, attacking on my behalf. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Yep, he's being withered by the shield. Very, very cool. <laughs> okay, but what else did he have for trade? A potion that removes lava around you, huh? Lava push. Ooh. That one sounds good. And then, of course, we're going to trade our friend away for an invincible end crystal. Well, it's no wonder the ender dragon would want that. Better we head to the nether to show off this potion, though. Okay, let's see. Lava push, huh? Whoa. <laughs> no way. Look at this. Look at this. Am I like... Am I stuck? <laughs> Let me see. I'll play some blocks down. Bro, it literally gets out of my way above me. Wow, no way. Hold on a second. Can we just... Yo! Too cool? 
It just keeps going. Oh, wow. Yo, this is a cool one. Okay. Wow. I got to see what this last trade is, though. Actually, quick in spectator mode. Uh, awesome. All right, Drum, what'll it be? Finally, the time has come for the dragon. Like the wither, use an emerald block. We'll trade ender pearls as well as the big special item you've been building up to. Interesting. Hmm. The big dragon sword. That sounds amazing. I might be able to join you on your journey, so just in case, may the force be with you. Sure, okay. I'm a little bit nervous. He's not yet tradable. He's not a tradable guy just yet. Um, but maybe we can, um, you know, negotiate. We're just gonna let homeboy land, and then, you know, maybe he'll trade with us then. Yeah, here we go. Okay, get right on him. What's good? Hey, I think I got him. Hey, he stopped moving. <laughs> Hi, buddy. You, you got some trades for me? Let me see. Can I trade you? How do I trade with you? Do I need to, like, be up at your level? Okay, that'll do it. I got something going. 16 ender pearls plus the invincible end crystal for a big dragon sword. Okay. Sharpness 10. And then look at this, guys. Dragon blight. What the heck is that? Okay, let's see what this does. Yeet! Nice. Ooh! It summoned in dragon's breath when I landed a hit on him. Hold on. Oh, well, that's the end crystal chest plate going right there. Let me see if I can do that again. Boom. <gasps> Legit. Legit. And it doesn't damage me. So I can hang out in the middle of it. Oh my gosh. There need to be way more villagers in Minecraft. Amazing trades. Thanks, Ender Dragon. You're the best. Also, I'm about to die. Make sure you subscribe.